everyone, so I'm getting ready for bed right now. I have my pajamas on, my bed is pulled back, I have my aromatherapy candle lit on my bedside table. Uh, my hair is up in my little clip so that I could wash my face and I have my glasses on, my contacts are out. Um, and I just kind of decided that I wanted to do a vlog video and I was kind of thinking to myself, I was like, you don't have anything to film, you don't have anything to talk about. And I was like, well, you do outfit of the day sometimes, so why don't you just do a pajama of the night? And I'm not exactly sure if this is going to be a successful idea, but I decided that I like would show you guys my pajamas and um, that's kind of as far as I got in the logic of this video before I sat down to film. And here's the thing. When I first started filming my vlog videos like two years ago, because I started my beauty channel three years ago, but only my vlog videos two years ago, and when I would film them, I never knew what I was going to talk about before I would sit down to film. And it's very weird right now filming with my glasses on. I don't think I've ever filmed a video with my glasses on instead of my contacts. And like I can only see clearly in this little section, so if I look over or under a little bit, it's really blurry. It's really confusing me right now. Um, but basically, when I used to film my vlog videos, I never knew what I was going to talk about before I sat down. I would just sit down and I would start talking and whatever I whatever I talked to you guys about would become the vlog video. And I feel like sometimes I, I lose perspective and I forget that because I will sit down and I will know exactly what I want to talk to you guys about and stuff. So right now I decided that I was just going to sit down and vlog to you guys and the best idea I could come up with was pajama of the night. So um, yeah, I have my hair up in a little clip and this is probably just from Sally Beauty Supplies or something. Glasses are on. I haven't washed my face yet because I was like, you should probably film before you wash your face. Um, but yeah, that's kind of what's going on there. I have a Connecticut t-shirt on and then for pants, I have these Victoria's Secret plaid flannel pants and then I have these Betsy Johnson, um, hold on, this is going to be difficult. I have these Betsy Johnson socks that have uh, lipstick tubes on them, which I thought were really, really pretty. And if you watched my tag video, what tag was it? It was the, um, I don't even remember what kind of tag it was. Oh, it was the Weird Facts tag. It actually asked um, what you sleep in at night, and my response was anything warm. I sleep in socks with long pants and typically a hoodie or a sweatshirt or something. So when I actually get ready to climb into bed, I'm going to put this hoodie on. Elle actually got this for me. She was an Alpha Chi Omega in college, and so I guess I'm an Alpha Chi Omega legacy because she's an Alpha Chi Omega or something. I don't know. She got this for me. So it's just a hoodie that I like to sleep in a lot. Um, so I will put that on. And that is what I will sleep in when I am ready to go. This video is only like three minutes long right now, and I've already finished my entire topic that I had to talk to you guys about. That's ridiculous. I have, however, been watching this TV show on ABC Family that I am so obsessed with because, okay, so there's this book, and I don't know if the book is called The Lion Game or if they just titled the show The Lion Game, but on ABC Family, I've seen the first three episodes, the show is called The Lion Game. It comes on on Monday nights, and um, I have been so addicted to watching this show, and it's written, er, it's based off a book that's written, no, I confused that. It's based off of a book, and the book is written by the same author that wrote Pretty Little Liars. So now ABC Family has two different shows on the same network that are both based off di different books written by the same author that either have lying or liar in the title. I love Pretty Little Liars, but I really, really, really love The Lying Game, but I haven't read the books that go along with The Lying Game. Like, before I started watching Pretty Little Liars, I had read the books. So like I kind of knew the plot line and the characters and the story and stuff, but I haven't read The Lion Game or whatever the book series is called for The Lion Game. Um, but have you guys been watching that show? It is absolutely amazing. You can watch it for free on abcfamily.com. I know if you live in the US. If you live out of the country, I know sometimes those sites are a little iffy with streaming videos, but um, you can definitely try it. And then also, I've been obsessed with watching Big Brother. So obviously I watch Big Brother US, but I hear there's also like really good seasons over in Big Brother UK or England or whatever. I know that they have like a series of Big Brother as well that's really popular. I love Big Brother. It is like my show of the summer. I wait for summer to come so that I can watch Big Brother. And it's kind of silly because I feel like they start airing it in the middle of summer and go like into fall when it's supposed to be like a summer show. 
I don't know. Anyways, yeah, so those are the two shows, and then obviously Keeping Up with the Kardashians. I love that show, but I've always liked that show. Um, those are the shows that I've kind of been obsessed Oh, and Bachelor Pad. Okay, so I've watched almost every season of The Bachelor and absolutely love it. Bachelorette watched like all of them. Bachelor Pad is absolutely amazing. Have you guys been watching that? I don't know why. I love TV shows. I don't, I like TV shows so much better than movies because I feel like movies, you almost, I don't know, I feel like you spend so much time watching a movie and movies are so long before you like actually are finished with them. I don't get bored during TV shows. I get bored during movies. I feel like in TV shows, I don't have time to get bored. In movies, I find myself looking at my phone, trying to find emails to respond to. Like I just do random things during movies because I get bored, but I don't get bored during TV shows. So that's why I like watching TV shows. I really like them. I feel like this is a kind of a hopeless vlog. I don't even know if I'm going to upload this at this point because I don't even know what I've talked about. I feel like everybody has their nighttime routine that they do every night and it becomes like so second nature to them. And I know that like when I used to spend the night with my friends in high school and stuff, like you're, it's funny how even if you're like not in your environment, you still kind of do the same things. Like I always put my hair up and I always take my contacts out obviously because like you can't sleep in those or I feel like there are a couple pairs that you can sleep in but I don't have sleep in contacts so I always take my contacts out I always take my makeup off but like even just the way like I always put lotion on my hands before I climb into bed and I have if I'm staying in my own house I always light an aromatherapy candle when I start getting ready for bed I light it and then once I climb into bed and stuff like sometimes I'll read a book for a little while or I might even watch a show on my laptop which I know you're actually not supposed to like watch TV within 30 minutes or an hour of trying to go to sleep because it like wakes up your brain cells or something. Um, I don't find I have a problem falling to sleep once I have like watched a TV show. So sometimes I'll watch a TV show or I will read a book and then I blow the candle out and then I have aromatherapy spray this right next to it. I don't know if the picture frame is covering it up, but it's uh, from Bath and Body Works as well. Oh, the candle's from Bath and Body Works and I spray that on my pillowcases and it's vanilla lavender or lavender vanilla, lavender vanilla pillow mist. And it smells so amazing. This is really weird filming in my glasses. I've like never filmed a video in my glasses before. This is strange. I think I'm gonna go ahead and go. I'm going to see if this video turns into anything uploadable. I might upload it just for the heck of it, just kind of for giggles, because I think it might be a silly video and I think it might be a very random, what was Blair thinking when she was filming this video kind of moment. Um, yeah, so. If you guys want to do a pajama of the night video, um, do it and leave it as a video. I'm like really proud of myself for thinking of pajama of the night and I probably didn't even come up with that, but I've never seen another one on YouTube. So if there is another one on YouTube, it's not technically copying because I haven't personally ever seen it. You know what I mean? So like, that's like if someone had never seen electricity before and they invented electricity, they still invented electricity. It doesn't matter if it's been done before because they invented something that they didn't know had ever been invented. Anyways, my point is, I've never seen a Pajama of the Night video before. If you guys wanna do a Pajama of the Night video, do it and leave it as a comment below. I feel like maybe, I don't know, maybe I wanna do like a nighttime, whoa. So what if I did one video that was like my morning routine and walked you through what I do in the morning and one video that's my nighttime routine and like walked you through what I do at night or even took the camera with me and showed you what I do at night. Like all the way from getting ready to like in my pajamas to getting into bed. That would be fun. All right. So I'm going to go. I'm going to talk to you guys later. But uh, leave a video as a video response below. And comment below and let me know what your favorite TV shows are. And if you've seen any of the shows I mentioned in this video. And if you found this video interesting in the least. All right. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.